and welcome back guys to what um I'm not gonna say this might well okay I guess I am it, this might very well be the final failure of the game um it also might not be but more likely than not it's going well I can't even, I don't even know if I want to say that it, it, it very well might be but also could not be but all I'm doing is searching around Hogwarts for um, anything, mostly cards, I don't give a shit about beans at this point. Um, and as I said in the last video, it's a lot easier and it takes a lot less time to search throughout Hogwarts in this game than it does in the PS2 versions of games 2 and 3. Hmm. We should do this. Ah. You saw me duel Draco. Okay, what I'll do is I will do one Wizard duel. I'll do just one. So you can see it again. There's ton of these, I think. It, it takes ton. And then I'll... I don't know. I'll get, like, Tranty if I win. Which I sold, hopefully. Potter, you will now duel a member of your own team. Don't expect any special treatment from them. Yeah, probably not. You see, the dueling in this game is pretty interesting. The dueling, I think I mentioned when I was dueling Drago, it's a hell of a lot easier. Uh, how do I, okay. A hell of a, it's a hell of a lot easier than, it's a hell of a lot easier. Oh. Well, I'd like to win this, but I forgot how much of a... Bitch this out. If I waste five minutes this video in this one duel, well, if for not, nothing else, you'll see the reason I'm not going to be doing all the duels. I'm so this away. Oh, did I get that your experience up there in time, did you? The dudes are a hell of a lot easier in uh, Half-Blood Prince. I'm pretty fun. If not, I'm repetitive. And way too easy. But if there's one thing Half-Blood Prince brought... You know, the open world. The game of it all is a lot easier than Order of the Phoenix. And the PC... And, by the, and actually, I was going to say on the PC, but those four sins... PC and... Um... um On, on the PC and the PlayStation and, and the console forces are the same. Uh, so the fifth game Potter has beaten a fellow Gryffindor. How very disloyal. Bitch, I had no choice. See the fifth game, I wouldn't say the fifth game was incredibly easy. You know, actually, to be fair, I'm not even done with play the fifth game. I haven't found, um, stuff for Luna. Oh, no, I don't want to go in there. That would on the game, so to speak. Okay. I was up there. <sighs> I've done this. Oh no, I haven't. All this time I've never done this bit. Okay. Muff. Mopsis. In the Greek, say who vanquished the seal Carcass in a contest of their powers. Okay. Ah. Uh, I don't have much to say about that because. I completely forget this card and that description. I mean, soothsay, I see it. Ah, uh, hmm, okay, interesting. <sighs> so, yeah, I'll probably have to just be playing Prisoner of Azkaban. Prisoner of Azkaban, the game, hmm. I, I, it's, I think, I think it's easier than this. I want to say it's easier, but there are some chances in the game that can be annoying, like 
with when you a human sign. Just I won't say any more. If you have it, well, I just won't say, say any more. The Hermione chance challenge, challenge chances in those games can be kind of annoying. Okay, I'll circle around this bit. Would you be interested in setting up while I'm walking? Okay, I've probably been up here as well. I don't know what it is, but I've played the PS, I'm sorry, the PC version of Prisoner of Azkaban a lot more than I've played the Chamber of Secrets version. I don't know why. What's this? Oh. This is the door to the Scourge Challenge. Yeah, I do know the Bloody Scourge Challenge. Nothing I need in the mall. No, okay. So this video is, I don't know, might be a bit boring. Oh, yeah, this one in here. But I just want to, you know, before I buy everything, just to get as much as I can without redoing challenges. It's good to see you again, Harry. Let me fucking in. Okay, thanks for trusting me and asking for a passport. Okay, once again. This is going to have like one bean in it. Yay. That was a really impressive chest. <sighs> okay, so up here there is... How do you do it? Pardon me? I, I think I said it before, but nice fucking hot man. Uh... I know there's... <sighs> Is it? There's something right there. No, there's something you hit. Oh, I see what it is. And it opens some stuff. Like I said, as far as I'm concerned, pretty well hidden. So I'm not sure we're not update all of these. I did again I really like this little hiding place. I ha I now have all the philosophers torn stuff up. I will update Chamber Secrets probably for the next three weeks. And unless I get more time to do more recording. You then I have to tide you guys over for a bit. Gwynog Jones, 1968 through present, captain and veto of only our female national critics team that hardly had hobbies. Hmm. If it's a national critics, national, I don't know if the national critics team implies that it's, see critics team in the kind of confusion because there's the regional British teams and there's the national crit, uh, critics team, like then there's the team who plays for um, the World Cup, I think there's other regional teams. I don't know, there's a hell of a lot of credits teams. And I'm not sure if I've, um, I completely ignore the girl last. I'm not sure that I have to trade in my head what credits teams do what. Because, well, well one thing causing confusion, and I know it's non canonical is Harry Potter Critics World Cup, where you can just play as the Bulgarian team. What's that mean? Is it a team of the vast players from the multitude of all of Bulgarian's local teams? So, it kind of confuses me. Okay, first floor done. Yeah, see, there are like what? Two, three. There are four floors that you look through. And that is it. Yeah, right. Okay. I don't really need the beans, but I mean, I'm not going to see the beans and not collect them. Okay. I don't have enough to open that. Five more, so six more cards. Okay. 
I've been through hay enough times, more likely than not. <sighs> This leads to McGonagall's classroom, which becomes more important than other games. Sorry, no time to talk. I'm in the Transfiguration classroom. As, as you think, it when I was lost in here, the Transfiguration classroom always looks the same in the game. It is, it, games, it's just not always in the same spot. Okay. Moaning Myrtle's bathroom. How depressing. Can I go back to and visit the chamber? Hmm. Oh, well, I think I was interrupted in saying, I think Hogwarts should have more, um, creature professors. Do you think I don't know what people call me behind my back? Miserable, moaning, moping myrtle. I think I joked about how, I think, I saw the bosses could be a professor with like a translator for Paul's tongue. I think I also maybe joked in a previous video, Air Gar could be a trans, for, could be a professor. I mean, we know they, at least Dumbledore, had no problem with hiring Oh, the, the Santa would have liked me for this. Um, well, non-humans, they wouldn't mind me calling non-humans, in fact, they'd be proud of it. They have no problem hiring non-human professors. I mean, if a basilisk is qualified to teach something, then uh, I think, in theory, with the right precautions, a basilisk could, in fact, be a professor at a school like Hogwarts and Air Gargan and any other speaking non-human um, entities. I don't know if princes are... because it's only princes we meet toward raiders. I don't know if they only speak in raiders which would be a, a pretty annoying professor or if they can be like you know non or so I don't know how that would look out, but I just think that would have been interesting if that had been the case. Well, I know there are fan fictions about it, but for some reason I highly doubt it. Although I guess there are fan fictions about everything. Okay, down with this office, where I saw like three ways to couch from, or maybe it's just two. Here's the defense against the dark arts classroom. Okay, that's... Okay, I have this room to deal with. I'll probably underfade you in this room. Okay. Okay. You can hit this, I, I think only spiders come out. Yeah. I'm not sure why it really hit it. There's nothing up here. I don't remember if it's a card in his chest or not. Maybe. Yes, there is. What's that for? The last branch card? Yes, it was. Ah, uh, and again, these names. Musta Dora Bob with 15, 20 through 1666. Composer of the Unfinished Wasting Sweet. I'm not sure I pronounced that right. I have to think about that. Which features an exploding tuba. Its performance has been banned since its last performance in 1902 when it blew the roof out of Ockley Town Hall. Okay, uh, I'll stop the video actually right here. I want to um, make some comments about this. Thanks for watching, guys. Nox might be the last video of the series. We'll see. Thanks for watching. I appreciate it. Like, review, whatever you want.